So, what are we looking for out here? Well, the map shows all these structures around the volcano. Some abandoned outposts, a handful of watchtowers. Watchtowers? Yeah, Avery was the most wanted man in the world. So if he was hiding something out here, it makes sense he'd need lookouts. One of those towers is right on the volcano. With Avery's treasure. Fingers crossed. Some ruins up ahead. Wait here. I'll go take a look. <coughs> oh, Victor. You still do a lot of traveling these days? Yeah, I try. I tend to pick jobs that get me away from the computer. <coughs> yeah, I was telling Nathan it's <coughs> shocking how much of the business has moved to the internet. I mean, I bet you have all sorts of options to get rid of hot dogs. Yeah, sure, but I prefer talking to clients face to face. <coughs> Hard to do that in a chat room talking to some guy named Antiquity Master 37. <laughs> yeah, I can see that. Hmm. Not much to see here. Well, ah, nothing worthwhile. Come on, let's keep going. Hey, so with our luck, what are the odds this volcano is going to erupt on us? Zero. It's extinct. Just, that's the first thing I looked up when we said we were heading for a volcano. That and where to rent the cheapest for me. Wait, Sully, you're telling me that you actually did some research? Can't let you be the know-it-all every time, kid. Would you look at that? A secret cave behind the waterfall. Gentlemen, we are on a pirate adventure. What are you, seven? <laughs> so, Victor, who is it that you know King's Base? Well, I'm <laughs> Of course. The deal went bad and I got arrested. I'm not bribing the police chief. Again, of course. And in the process of negotiating the bribe, we... Uh, Point to well, maybe we can preempt any trouble we might get into. Can you still reach out to him? Her. Oh, my mistake. <laughs> it wasn't like that for once. We just saw the world in similar ways. Besides, she moved. Brazil. It's been a few years since we've seen each other. Maybe time for a visit. Maybe. First, let's wrap this up. All right, let's get moving. A little warning next time. That's the first time in years I've had two showers in one day. That bridge there is what you would call rickety. This looks promising. Come on, come on, baby. Let's go, 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 go. Made it. Okay, kid. Just don't drop us. Hey, just keep it slow. Keep it in the center. Yeah, there's a lot of backseat driving going on. Ah! We're good. Everything's good. Jesus Christ. Onward and upward. I'm getting nowhere fast. Slip and slide. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Oh, 
Jesus. Oh, my spine. Look, tire tracks. Someone came up this way. Hey, look up there on the hill. Got a tower or something. Now we're talking. Hey, Victor, what were you arguing with the rental guy about? Oh, your brother insisted on getting a 4x4 with a winch. So you sprung for the winch, but you couldn't spring for the suspension. I got it. Hey, it's important. Going off-road. It might rain, might be muddy. How about we go through this whole goddamn thing and never use that winch? Oh, shit! Take this slow, kid. Yeah. So, Nathan, you're thinking Avery, too, and some other big shot pirates pulled their treasure and came out here because... why exactly? Who knows? Maybe for protection? British authorities were closing in on them. Sure. Maybe, uh, he helped them disappear. I mean, the guy clearly had a knack for hiding things. And go. And no. That was a valiant effort. Let's go check out that tower. I'll come with. It's in pretty good shape or something several hundred years old. Yeah. Definitely ruins from Avery's era. <laughs> Sam, look. That's Christopher Condon's sigil. He's uh, captain of the Fiery Dragon, operated out of Madagascar around Avery's time. So maybe Avery recruits pirate captains to what be his lookouts? That don't make any sense. No, it doesn't. Well, maybe each captain was responsible for a tower, along with providing the men for it. Whatever the case, this certainly isn't our final stop on our tour. stripped away. Something was wrapped around this tree. Hey, did you know our car came with a winch? No, really? I didn't know. What you gonna do with it? Not sure yet. Do it. Well, oh, oh, oh. oh, that looked like fun. Steeper than it looks. All right, ready? Give it a shot. Here we go. Steady. Steady. Sully? Winch. Totally worth it. We cleared a hill. It hasn't exactly paid for itself. Well, not yet. Small victories. Yeah, well, I'll celebrate the big ones. <laughs> Feast your eyes, gentlemen. Wow. Spectacular. 
Just imagine, you've come here, a well-to-do pirate far away from your oppressive government. Ha <laughs> poor oppressed pirates. All they wanted to do was to murder and pillage in peace. No, no, they wanted to live as free men. Well, if you're gonna pick a place to run away from society, you could do a lot worse than here. It's taking forever to get to this volcano. Patience, Victor, patience. Do you know how those pirates got here? They had to start in England, sail to Brazil, then cut back across the Atlantic to South Africa. Damn. And they figured all that out with paper, charts, and by looking at the stars. Hey, you're describing sailing to a former squid. The point is, we got it pretty easy. Yeah, well, still taking a long time. What do we got? Military types poking around. Nadine's guys? Yep. Son of a bitch. Yeah. Looks like they found an old colony outpost. But the wrong one, right? That's the good news. Yeah, that means it's bad news. The only route to the volcano is straight through them. Oh, shit. We do have the drop on them. What's the play here, Nathan? Just follow my lead. How's it? You have that dungus hooked up yet? We're all set up. Just wait till approval. <coughs> Good. Place looks empty. I'd like to get it over with and move on. <coughs> so how long we posted? Yeah. Short orders to come in. Any news from the Hang on. Call them and let them know we're ready. Orders are to sit tight. How's it? You got anything? Wait, hello? Just put hey, me in charge. You okay? Get the whole thing done in half the time. <coughs> Considering the last time the land will explode and nearly blew up everyone in the street, I'd say it's a good thing you're not in charge. <laughs> half the time. I'll be sure to run that by no team. Let's go, gentlemen. It's gonna be a hot, long day, and we have lots to do. Those Drake boys show their pretty faces. You all know what to do. They serve them right, too. Just hope I bag them first.
Hmm? Heads up! I have something. Got job back, China. Got them right here! I think that's it. God damn it. Rafe and Nadine must have dozens of guys out here. I mean, they, they could just stumble onto the treasure through blind luck. Well, looks like Nadine hasn't given up on excavation by explosions. Rafe can't be happy about that. I don't think Rafe has much of a say in the matter. sigil. Huh. Adam Baldridge. He ran King's Bay for a while. He was a traitor, slaver, general scoundrel. Look at you. Yeah. Prison. A lot of books. Jesus, these pirates really need to work on their infrastructure. Now, how do we get out of here? Sully. Pretty handy, right? I wasn't against getting the winch. I was against getting ripped off. <laughs> I got mud in my mouth. <laughs> uh. Sully, just how well do you know Nadine? Why? I was thinking maybe you can contact her, convince her to call off her goons. <laughs> yeah, right. What if we promise her a bigger cut than Ray? No, that's not how she operates. She's more of a money up front kind of mercenary. The rape's got the advantage there. Stay put. I'll just wait with Sam. <laughs> I'm good. Let's go. Look, shoreline. Yeah, they're definitely going all in, aren't they? And getting awful close to that volcano. He's thinking the same damn thing. If they found the treasure already. Well, look, they're searching every inch of this place. If they'd found it already, they wouldn't be searching. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. Hey, Sam. If you don't mind me asking, how'd you pass the time in prison? Uh, you know, reading, mostly. There was this one guard saw me as a charity case, I guess. He had to check out books from the library for me. So what'd you read? <laughs> History, uh, especially anything related to Avery and other pirates. Just in case, you know. Sure. Well, you know, besides books, push-ups, smoking, trying to stay out of fights between rival gangs. Ah, hell. See that smoke? 
Ooh, shoreline, slow down. <clears throat> Let me know when I can open my eyes. Sam, what were you talking about? Uh, oh, right. Trying to stay out of fights between rival gangs. <laughs> um, check this out. What if that's man-made or natural? Looks to me to be half and half. Sorry, you were saying? Um, no. Oh, right. Trying to stay out of fights between rival gangs. It's a whole lot of thinking. Pretty much it. Sam, if you had a guard doing you favors, why didn't you use him to get word to us? Oh, I tried. I asked him. Hey, is that a well? Well, well, well. <laughs> get it? You know, because... You know, well... Sully, you stole your joke. What have we here? Did you find something down there? Maybe. Do me a favor, get behind the wheel for a sec. Will do. Hey, Sully, throw the car in reverse. What do we have here? So, nothing major. I'll show you back at the hotel. 
Okay, remind me what we were talking about. Um, no. Oh, right. Oh, I tried. I asked them to mail a letter to your P.O. box. I never got it. That would be because the warden saw it. I got busted up pretty bad and never saw that guard again. Jesus. I got my own back when the warden decided to room me with Alcazar. That didn't turn out how he expected. You know, come to think of it, I actually dealt with Alcazar a few decades ago, even before I met you two. Oh, shit. How are you still alive? Well, he wasn't quite the man he is today. Still working his way up the criminal ladder then. I sold his boss a few woodcut prints I'd smuggled out of Japan. He was into shoguns and such. Alcazar was the go-between. What was he like? Soft-spoken, but intense. Like you could explode at the slightest provocation. <laughs> well, he hasn't changed much then, has he? I got my money and got the hell out of there. All right, one sec. You got something, kid? Let's go. Fire walks into a boat. Okay, here we go. And he's got the steering wheel sticking out of his crotch. All right. So the bartender goes, hey, man, what's with the wheel? And the pirate says back, ah, he's driving me nuts. <laughs> ah, not that way. Don't make me leave you out here. Looks like Shoreline found something. Go slow. You got it.
that. I think we gave them the slip. Yeah, but they could call for help. It's not like they don't know we're here already. Right. Check it out, boys. What is it? You can probably see all of King's Bay from up here. Yeah. Hey, look. There's the city. And there's the river valley. Hey, guys, there's another tower just over the hill. See any shoreline marks? You can't tell. Look at this. Quite the view. I just keep waiting to wake up and find myself in solitary or something. <laughs> it's all some kind of dream. Sam. No, oh, no, no guilt trip. I'm just... Let's go find this thing. You bet. So, how are you doing? Yeah, still in one piece. I appreciate you coming along for the ride. And especially for negotiating with that rental guy. <laughs> no problem. Hell, I'd be lying if I said I wasn't enjoying myself. <laughs> Me too. <clears throat> Who made these cairns? Must be a trail marker. Let's keep an eye out for them. Would appear we got here first. Let's uh, check the place out and keep moving. <laughs> what do you make of the drawbridge, Nathan? A little out of place. But you don't put up a drawbridge unless you're trying to protect something. Such as pirate treasure? <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> yeah. Another sigil. So, do you recognize this one? I do, actually. And Bonnie. Hmm? Operated out of the Caribbean. Thought she died in jail. At least that's what the stories tell us. <laughs> right. Avery must have invited her too. Check this out. The hell, the stairs are busted. There's no way up to the crank. I'll see if I can find something to stand on.
Hey guys, there's a massive tower just past the drawbridge. Biggest one yet. Sam, special delivery. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hey kids, you all right? I'm fine. You all right? Yeah. You got this? Mm -hmm. I seen it. You just relax. I got this. I mean, there's only one crank, you know. <laughs> Keep up the good work, kid. that bridge down. Let's try that again. There we go. Tower on a volcano. Looks like the end's in sight, huh? <clears throat> Sorry. Now, not to nitpick, but Avery spent all that money on towers. Would it have killed him to put a guardrail up here? Well, things 
worth a try. Slip and slide. <laughs> To take a look around. So, just how much do you owe Alcazar? Uh, yeah. half of what? Well, he only knows about the Gunsway heist, which is worth 400 million. Right, but if Nathan's theory is correct, then there's a lot more treasure. Well, you should have told him it was 200,000. You never tell your partners how much a job is really worth. I wasn't exactly expecting to be partnered. set. sharing this one with my shrink. <laughs> Wait, you have a shrink? No, but I will after this. Come on, you guys are overreacting. Get the whole thing under control. Hold on to something. <laughs> ah. ah, that was a nice change of pace. Yeah, I'm almost disappointed. Uh, uh, almost. Now, let's find our way in. Let's go claim our treasure, boys. Sam, give me a hand with this. Yeah. Let's see what we got here. Huh. There's something back here. Sam? Yeah. Let's do this. Breaked over. All right, let's look around. Hey, careful with that thing, kid. Heads up! God, Jesus! I said heads up!
excited. Uh, he's got a lot riding on this. Don't see a treasure, though. Guys, coming. Come check this out. St. Dismas. We meet again. So, what do we got? More sigils. There's our boy Avery. Thomas, too. And that's, uh... Um... That's Adam Baldridge, that's uh, Joseph Farrell, and that's Richard Warren. Hmm. Pirate captains. All right, so maybe your pirate pool theory wasn't so ridiculous after all. <laughs> all right, so, uh... Let's see, what do you think the trick is here? You gotta push a button, pull something? Well, maybe... Maybe one of the arms, or... Yeah, give it a shot. Whenever you're done fondling poor St. Dismas, I think you might want to come take a look at this. Trapezoid is obviously the volcano. The crown, that's King's Bay. We got ourselves a map, gentlemen. Victor, you're a goddamn genius. Hear that, Nate? Genius. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so if we're here, this tower lines up with Avery Sigil. Okay, so then the other sigils must be the towers from Avery's time. Well, I mean, a treasure's got to be in one of them, right? Yeah, but which one? I count 12 towers. Hey, uh, Victor? Huh? You didn't start smoking cigarettes by any chance, did you? Looks like we're not the first ones here. 